So the next type of bar diagram is a percentage bar diagram. So let's take an example. The following table represents the number of trucks and the number of buses for a particular year. To calculate the percentage bar diagram, we need three more columns. One is the total, the other is percentage of trucks and the last one percentage of buses. The total column can be directly found out by adding the number of trucks and the buses. For the year 2005 and 6, 47 plus 9 will give you 56. Similarly, for the other three years, it's 69, 76, and 81. Now, how do you calculate percentage of any category? So, percentage value is found out by the formula value upon total into 100. So, the percentage of trucks will be found out by trucks, number of trucks, upon total into 100. So, the first year, 2005, 2006, has 47 trucks and a total of 56. So the percentage of trucks will be 47 upon 56 into 100. That comes to 83.93. Similarly, for the other years, for the year 2007, 2008, the number of trucks is 56 and the total is 69. So the percentage of trucks is 56 upon 69 into 100. That comes out to 81.16. Similar calculation goes on for the other two years. Now, we need to approximate the percentage to the nearest integer. So the percentage 83.93 can be converted into 84. Similarly, 81.16 gets converted into 81. 78.95 will be approximately equal to 79. And 77.78 will be approximately equal to 78. So once we have done with the calculation of percentage of trucks, we can now move on to percentage of buses. The total percentage amounts to 100. So the percentage of buses will be percentage of 100 minus percentage of trucks. So 100 minus 84 will give you 16. Similarly, for the other years, the calculation goes on in the same way. We just need to subtract the percentage of trucks from 100. Once you have done with the calculation of the percentage, we will now move on to our construction of our graph that is percentage bar diagram. On the x-axis we will represent the year whereas on the y-axis we will represent the percentage from 0 to 100. Our total percentage for any year is always 100. So we'll make a bar of 100 each for every year. Once we make the graphs, now it's time to represent the percentage of trucks and the buses. The percentage of trucks for the year 2005-2006 is 84. So I'll mark a line at a height of 84 in the first graph. Similarly, for the next year, the percentage of trucks is 81. I'll mark a line at a height of 81 for the second year. So the above portion represents the number of buses, whereas the below portion represents the number of trucks. All we have to do is shade the below portion or the above portion to represent the number of trucks and buses. This is your percentage bar diagram.